Liverpool were held to a 2-2 draw by Brighton at the Amex Stadium in an entertaining encounter. Mohamed Salah scored a brace for the Reds, who had to come from behind, after a defensive error allowed Simon Adingra to open the scoring for the hosts. Lewis Dunk equalized late on for the Seagulls, who denied Liverpool their 10th consecutive win in all competitions. The game saw Ryan Gravenberch make an impact off the bench for Liverpool replacing Harvey Elliott at halftime. The Dutch midfielder almost scored the winner for the visitors, but his close-range shot hit the bar. He also showed his defensive qualities by breaking up several Brighton attacks. Elliott, who started on the right of the midfield three, had a quiet game and was involved in the mix-up that led to Brighton's first goal. He gave the ball away to Lucas Paqueta, who played a through ball to Adingra. The striker rounded a listen and slotted into an empty net. Salah equalized for Liverpool with a smart finish from Darwin Nunez's pass. He then put the Reds ahead from the penalty spot after Dominic Sobislai was fouled by Pascal Gross. The Egyptian star equaled Roger Hunt's record of scoring in nine consecutive league games and became the fastest player to reach 100 Premier League goals for Liverpool. However, Brighton fought back and leveled the score in the 83rd minute. Dunk headed home from a corner after Virgil van Dijk failed to clear the ball. Joao Pedro had a chance to win it for Brighton in stoppage time, but he shot wide from a good position. Liverpool manager Jurgen Klopp praised Salah for his goals and said that he was disappointed with the result. He said, he is an incredible player and he showed it again today. He is always hungry and always wants to score, but we should have won this game and we didn't. We made too many mistakes and we gave them too many chances. Brighton boss Roberto De Zerbi said that he was proud of his team and that they deserved a point. He said, we played very well in the first half and we scored a good goal. In the second half, we suffered a bit more, but we never gave up. We showed character and quality and we got a fair result against a top team.